good morning or afternoon or whenever you're watching or whenever this. you're watching this maybe you're watching it in middle school the middle school experience xms as we like to call it it's your boys the homies judah jesse judah's wearing his gas station sunglasses not gas station walgreens <laughs> <laughs> so we're coming at you today with fresh some fresh content and what that content is gonna be we have not figured it out yet so that's where it gets tough is where you have a an awesome video like last week a killer one and then you're like all right what do we do next week i will say that making last week's video was one of the most uncomfortable experiences of my entire life personally. yeah we're just looking for some perps all right so we had an idea um, we were gonna go to that place right there. Can you see it? Mini golf course. Can you see the waterfall? Oh, that, that tree right there is in the way. Okay, we were gonna go there. We were gonna play a spicy round of mini golf and it was gonna be fun. And uh, you know, who knows, maybe we would have recreated that vine where the kid hits it in and then jumps in the water. Oh gosh, um, don't tempt me. But there goes Becca. Hi. No, 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 we need you. Um, we were gonna go putt-putting, and then it's closed. That little place back there. What do you think we should do? <laughs> I was thinking that we could go find a switch. Well, Eddie already has one. Well, there goes that. I'm, for some reason, I'm thinking of like going into like Best Buy and Walmart and doing something funny with the employees. Like, like we ask them something funny or dumb. Jesse's hating it already. I hate this. <laughs> I feel like what we should do, because we haven't done this in a while, we should probably just go to Starbucks. <laughs> no! <laughs> Starbucks again? Okay, I have an idea. Hold on, make sure it's recording. Okay, here's an idea. Just what if... What? <laughs> I had a thought, and then I just accidentally said your name, and so I just ruined your bit, so... Continue. <laughs> you know how places have secret menus? Mm -hmm. What if we find a secret menu item that sounds good and we go to that place and try to order it and see if it's real? Mm -hmm. All right, here is 30 secret menu items at every fast food chain. Oh boy. Chipotle nachos. Chipotle nachos, that's crazy. Five Guys patty melt. Ugh. McDonald's grilled cheese. <gasps> McDonald's grilled cheese? Oh, wait, let's try the um, the Burger King vegan burger. Veggie Whopper. There we are. Oh, let's do that. I mean, it's not really a secret, but I've it's always wanted- a, It's literally the next one on the list. It's right here. But it's not a secret though. Burger it, King Veggie Whopper. It's a, it, they were like promoting it. Let's so. get some Veggie Whoppers. All right, here we go. Okay, so if you throw back to one of the episodes we had during quarantine, 60 something, we tried a Dave single a Whopper and a Big Mac. Mm -hmm. And uh, the Whopper lost in mm -hmm. last place, which we weren't surprised. But it was surprisingly good. But it was surprisingly better than what we anticipated. Yeah. So, hey, I'm all about, uh, you know, a good veggie option. <laughs> That's not true. It's 100 degrees in this car right now. I'm sorry. So uh, we're going to go away for a while. Yeah. Because you won't be able to hear us when the air conditioning's on. <sighs> we'll, we'll see you at Burger King. Hello, um, do you guys have the vegan burger? All right, can I get two of those? Okay. I'll do two bottled waters, and that's it. Already anything else? That is it. So that was funny. I almost forgot to record when we pulled in. Um, so yeah, it's called the Impossible Whopper. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it is with a Whopper. Yeah. <laughs> I totally was not listening. Did she say first window or second window? Because this one's doesn't have anything on it. But there's no one there. Is the Impossible Burger good? Yeah, it's all right, I guess. I don't like the smell of it. I think it smells like dog food. Dog food? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, that's... I'm really happy I got it. Hey, but if you go ahead and pull forward, we'll put fresh ones down for you. They don't like the smell that much, so we gotta keep them can't imagine. Yep. Thanks, dude. I ain't gonna eat that. I can eat that. Give me a pig. 
Actually, it's cow. <laughs> Beef is cow. <laughs> <laughs> I want my burger like, <laughs> like normal. Pig. <laughs> Branch from last week, we were talking about comparison. This week, we're kind of, kind of, like, it's like, um, it's not comparison. I would say it's probably the opposite of comparison. Um, instead of you comparing yourself to someone else, and you're just, you're looking at what you don't have, you're looking, we're gonna be talking about celebration, and how you're looking at someone else and their gifts, and encouraging them, uplifting them, and celebrating with them for what God is doing. Um, because when you do that, when you're an uplifter of other people, you actually enjoy your life a lot more. You're actually a lot happier. I don't know if anyone's ever noticed that you go on a missions trip, you serve at church, you do something nice, and then it's like for someone else, and you feel fantastic. Mm -hmm. It's because you're not focusing on yourself. So we're going to talk about that. Yeah, so how last week we talked about how comparison is something that really affects us negatively. Um, almost like how you combat comparing yourself to other people is just before you ever begin to compare is just celebrate people before you ever start to think of like oh man I wish I had that or I wish I could go on that vacation instead of saying that before you do that say man I'm so happy they got to do that that's cool good for them you know yeah and it almost stops you from saying well I wish I had that and instead it shifts to being excited for them and celebrating them Hey, thanks, bro. <laughs> I see you, man. <laughs> One star, Yelp. Well, what the heck? <laughs> okay. He said, enjoy that dog food. I like their fries. I don't like, their large fry is literally like a small fry. That's a large fry? Yeah. Bro. Yeah, you get robbed. But they taste really good, though. All right. Are we sure that's an Impossible Whopper? It looks just like a regular patty. It feels like a regular patty. You can kind of tell it's like not meat. Maybe it's just a giant scam. <laughs> it's just like <laughs> it's a straight burger. It's pig. <laughs> it's. <laughs> I guess there's no other way going around it. Just gotta dig right in. Are you about to eat that upside down? What is it? Yes. You, you judge me on my snacks. I'm eating the bag upside down. Yes, I eat my burger upside down. Okay. Big whoop. <laughs> Big whopper. <laughs> well. Whoa. It's good. All right. Want to try it? Yeah, I do. It's four o'clock and I haven't eaten yet today. We should start getting like one burger and we have to eat after each other. That'd be really funny. Well, that's good for COVID season. <laughs> I remember talking about this when we did the Whopper Big Mac thing, that the Whopper is the biggest burger by far. Like the biggest this way. Like it's the most bang for your buck for sure. Yeah. But, all right. I'm so interested to see what you think. <laughs> Not even saying anything, it's just going for the second bite. Second bite is good. Jesse would not go for a second bite if it was not good. Um, yeah, okay, so I would agree with you. It's not bad by any stretch, but there's something that's just not quite the same. Mm hmm yeah. But it's good. It you know, like, I'll probably eat the whole thing. It like chews weird. Like, it's not like, I wouldn't say rubbery, but. It almost like breaks apart too easy. Mm -hmm. Not bad. So it's like plants. So I guess it's just plants, right? Or it's just not meat. <laughs> it's like just processed mystery meat. Junk. We have a, a standard that uh, the staff at X-Church, we talk about a lot. Um, and that is we like to celebrate a lot. And that really talks about just celebrating all the things that God has done in our ministry and in our church and all that stuff. But I think that can be easily applied to the comparison game too. Of like, we want to celebrate so much that we never even have the opportunity to compare ourselves in a negative way to other people. Yeah. Because all the time we just want to celebrate what God is doing in other people's lives, the opportunities they have, the gifts, the skills, 
uh, the blessings that they have and uh, just celebrate it, not be jealous of it. Yeah, it's really hard to think like badly about yourself or to compare yourself when you're celebrating. Mm -hmm. It's almost like when you worship, it's hard to like worry when you're worshiping God. Like worry or worship over worry. That's what we like say sometimes. Like, so it's kind of like that. Man, eating healthy is awesome. Mm. <laughs> yep, me, Judah, and Tucker were texting last night and decided that we were going to eat healthy starting today. So. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, Jesse, 0 out of 10, or 1 out of 10, what would you rate the burger? Mm, I mean, it was good. I ate the whole thing, yeah. and I don't feel like garbage. Mm -hmm. So that's cool. Um, I mean, if I ever eat at Burger King again, I might get it again. Just because I don't feel like garbage right now. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I say like a seven. Okay. I'll give it an eight. I think it was pretty good. Pretty good. Mm. Not the best. I was room for improvement. <laughs> good though. Um. Maybe you guys want to try it out. The vegan burger. It's crazy. It's impossible. That's why it's called the Impossible Burger. We're at Kroger, so we're gonna go shopping. But thank you guys for watching this week, episode eighty-one. Um. And uh, remember to celebrate, not compare. Yes, yes. You'll be a happier, better version of yourself if you choose to celebrate others mm. and not compare yourself to others. Mm. Man, that was really good, Jesse. Good Thank job. You. See ya. Did you see what I did there? I celebrated. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>